It's been 12 years since Tiffany Hollis was killed in a drive-by shooting on Jacksonville's west side. She was 16 years old. Hollis's killer still has not been found. Today, family and friends held a vigil for her. News for Jack's reporter Bree Isom joins us live. Bree, they want to keep her name and story alive. Yes, her mother was telling me that the pain is still the same 12 years later, and she says she won't stop saying her name or telling her daughter's story until her killer is found. How does it feel 12 years later? It still feels like it happened yesterday. Sunday marked 12 years since 16-year-old Tiffany Hollis was killed in a drive-by shooting. It happened at the intersection of Calvin and Belford Street in the Mixon Town neighborhood. Her sister, T. Amber Hollis, was in the car when Tiffany was shot. Her last words were, oh God, and she fell into my lap in the car. We can move on, Father. Thank you. We can shout on, Father. Yes. We can pray on, Father. Yes. On Sunday afternoon, family and friends wore her favorite color, purple, at a vigil that was held at the intersection where she was killed. I haven't been out here for four years, and... You know, my heart breaks every time I come out here. Shonda Whitaker Ward, Tiffany's mother, says she came back to this dreaded place and held this vigil, not only for her daughter, but because she wants the gun violence in Jacksonville to stop. It's not just about Tiffany. You know, it's about all the senseless violence that's going on in Jacksonville. And I just want, you know, our mothers to stand up and and, and our fathers and our communities and say, hey, this is enough. You know, if you find out what your kids are involved in. These candles stand for Tiffany Dawson Hollis. They said prayers and shared memories of the 16-year-old. Tiffany was um, a very, a very special child. She really was. She was everything that a mother would want for a teenager. Ward thanks God for two-year-old twin girls who she says remind her of her beloved daughter, Tiffany. They they look fashionate just like Tiffany was. Tiffany was into fashion, you know, loved her high heels. I just, I wish my baby was here. They little memories of her. Yes, they are. And on Thursday at 1030, there will be a march through the Mixon Town area where Tiffany was killed. I'm reporting live in Jacksonville, Bree Isom, Channel 4, the local station.